there's something about this town if you're from here. I think I grew up in the greatest era of Seattle history. I've seen it go through so much. I mean, I like to think it's paralleled my life. This town figured some things out a long way. My formative years of watching real bands was here. The Showbox was the most legendary club in Seattle. Punk rock had sort of grown up and got its own place. You'd see the Buzzcocks, and you'd see X, and you'd see Ted Kennedy, and Iggy it was all here. I mean, your imagination just kind of ran wild. We were only like 28, and we got the Lifetime Achievement Award. But it's a good place you can put a toilet paper roll right in here, and these come out. It's wild to think that I've written two books on the BlackBerry. This device means business for me. When I got the job writing columns, I've been touring the world. I would write the column on my BlackBerry. Writing columns is a lot like writing a song. You have inspiration, and you got to write it. This little device became my journal on the road. I really like learned a lot over time. Family and friends are the most important thing to me. I'm a husband and father first. I've played in, in some big bands. And I also write. Besides that, I'm a motorcyclist. I, I like to climb mountains. There's a lot going on. This phone, in all the things I do, it's my communication device, and I get real work done on this thing. Regardless of what it is I'm doing, BlackBerry will be part of it. Rule number 78. Don't shy away from a situation just because it's tough. Life doesn't slow down. Pin those ears back and remember who the f you are. My name is Duff McKagan, and this is my BlackBerry story. <laughs>